All right, so today is one of my absolute favorite days of the year. It is the 4th of July, America's Independence Day, and on the 4th of July, I like to do some very American things. So, uh, because we had recently taken the little shorty AR-10 here out the other day, um, and if you guys saw that video, it made short work of getting on plate at 1,471 yards. And one of the things I was really impressed with was how repeatable it was at those types of distances. So a very American rifle in the AR-10, little AR platform, DMR style rifle, um, and in a very American cartridge, the 308 Winchester. Um, I was really impressed with how it performed, but one of the things that impressed me the most was how repeatable it was. We had a lot of wind that day, and I had a really good feeling that if the wind was less, um, we would be able to do a much more precision shot at those same types of distances. So, today we took this thing out to 1,460 yards um, and set a can of spray paint directly in front of the 24-inch plate and made very short work of it again. So in three shots, we were able to put one dead center of the can of spray paint at 1461. And then a little bit later, we laid back down and I laid down a three-shot group on the Ipsic next to it. And the thing grouped like four inches at that t at those crazy distances for such a short little 308, which is inherently not as as flat of a shooting cartridge as a lot of the other cartridges you see me shoot so just the fact that it was able to get out to those distances but then be that repeatable at those distances is really incredible so hope this is uh something you guys enjoy uh very american rifle very american cartridge on america's independence day at 1461 so I'll see you guys next time i'm out Okay, so we got the Shorty AR-10 downrange at 1,460 yards. I got the 24-inch plate. In the center of that plate, I have a can of spray paint. There's an orange balloon on the plate to signify impact. So let's see. This is a long way for an amp for a little shorty gas gun, anyway. But let's see if not only can we get on, but we can't knock this thing out here. Okay, that had to have went right over the top. Okay. Three shots at 1450 with a little 18 inch AR 10 smashing a can of spray paint. This thing is accurate. I mean, accurate with these 168s. It's really incredible. All right, so third round impact. So I saw the first one, saw some grass move back there, so I knew I was over the top. Second one, I saw a little bit of dust underneath, and the third one, I cut the distance and or cut the uh, two elevations in half and dropped it right in the center, right where this was hanging, and it could not have been much more of a center impact. So right in the center of the label, there's the entrance. There's the exit, so like pretty much a dead center shot. Third round, little shorty AR-10, 168 ELDMs from 1,460 yards. This is probably one of my favorite shots I've ever done because of the difficulty with the platform I was using. There's just not a whole lot of velocity out of a short AR-10 like that. And uh, this thing is extremely accurate and extremely consistent even out here at distance. Could not be happier with it.